So qualifying is complete and we're all set for an exciting race tomorrow. Your top three are Ticktum, Lungard and Callum Eilat. With qualifying complete, all that remains is the main event. We'll be live and uninterrupted for the feature race tomorrow, so make sure you join. Welcome to the Australian Formula 2 race, which is almost ready to get underway. Everyone is getting prepped on the start line and the action should kick off any moment. First raced in 1996, this race circuit is one of the fastest on the calendar and despite the lack of elevation changes, it's also one of the most thrilling to watch due to the varying corner types and high speed straights, meaning there's something for every fan of the sport. Couple this with the typically gorgeous Australian weather and it's easy to see how this has become such an incredibly popular race event. As we await the start of another hugely anticipated Formula 2 race, I'm joined again by Davide Valsecchi. Davide, as a former GP2 champion, can we get some insight to what is running through these young drivers' heads as they sit out on the grid? Ciao, Alex. It's a pleasure to be here. There are nervy moments. There is no doubts about that. Mental strength is the key to remaining calm and focusing on the upcoming race. Formula 2 is so competitive and all of these drivers know that they are going to be pushing each other all of the way. In these sports, you have to be able to control your nerves. And here are the driver grid positions for today's race. Daniel Tictum lines up on pole position, with Christian Lungard alongside. Looking down the rest of the grid, we have Eilot, Schwartzman, Nobuharu Matsushita, and Sato, Aitkin, Mazepin, Dragovic, Giuliano Alesi, Sonoda, Joe, Mick Schumacher and Armstrong, Piquet, Delatrat, Marcolo and Luca Giotto, Deruvela, Nisani, Samaya and Sean Galeo completes the grid. Now it's almost time to lights out, so let's go down to the track.
great work. That's a new fastest lap of the race. Worked hard for that one. Congratulations. So as they climb out of the car, the ART team are ready and waiting to celebrate a thoroughly deserved win. So, Davide, how exactly did they set themselves apart from the pack today? I think this race was won thanks to the tyre management. You have to remember, it's not just about going as fast as you can. It's about consistency. It's about maintaining your speed over the entire race distance. So being able to keep the lap time competitive while still respecting the tyres, that's where they won today. An amazing race today, and a very well-deserved one too. The team worked very hard to get exactly the right setup out of the F2 car. It works for them, and the results speak for themselves. ARTGP winners today. Now then, Davide Valsecchi, who would you say was your driver of the day? Let's give it to Christian Lungard. That was a quality drive from start to finish. He can be proud of that one. After all...